mainly work on statistics, so uh, designing experiments, producing statistical models, analysing data for our chemists, engineers and the people that are developing products. I sometimes go to industry meetings, often across Europe, where we'll be talking to people from other companies who are doing similar work to Lubrizol. I work with colleagues and customers all around the world, so in the US, in mainland Europe, India, Japan, China. I use statistics, optimization, data analytics to try and provide insight into products that we are developing. One of the biggest projects I've been working in since I started was an optimization project. So I was trying to write a multi-objective optimization algorithm to find formulations which will meet a specification for our engine oils at the lowest possible cost. The types of products we make at Lubris are huge. We work within the additives industry to try and provide lubricants for all different types of engines. We also work within what we call the advanced material side, so that's things like shampoos and performance enhanced clothing. So working here you get a real range of different products which offer different unique opportunities. Uh, I think one of the best things about working at Lubrizol is that you get the freedom to explore your own ideas and your own um, solutions to problems so you get to work with the chemists and engineers to start from the very beginning and then develop your approach to a problem um, and we've got a lot of freedom as statisticians to have our own say and our own insight into what we're doing. I enjoy working at Lubrizol, you get to choose the direction of your own projects and manage your own workload, I think we're quite well respected within the company. To work in this position you need to have great statistics and computing knowledge and skills and to be good at collaborating with other people and understanding their problems and coming up with uh, a good solution for them. If you're looking at applying, I think we're looking for people with good uh, statistics and computing knowledge, people who are problem solvers. I'd say that to work here you need to be creative so as well as having the statistics or the computing knowledge, you have to be able to apply that in quite unique settings. So it's how you can take your information and apply it to something which maybe isn't quite as standard as what you're used to in your education.